Hello everyone, in this video we are going to see about the Cognizant SQL question. In this PDF you can find September 2024 to June 2025 SQL question. Without wasting into your time we will get back to the questions what they are going to ask. Uh, if you want more videos regarding Cognizant you can subscribe this channel and for more doubts you can join our telegram. First, we will look uh, what are the contents we are going to see in this video. First, you are going to see the SQL practice questions and tips and tricks. Like I will share you what are the tips and tricks you have to follow to crack this assessment. Next, we will discuss how the questions and their pattern going to be. Next, we will look into the questions. The questions asking that to display student id first name of their email id whose domain is aol.com and their first name start with p use alias student id first name email uh, they have given to use this kind of alias we will discuss like how we should think about the answers First, if you see in the thinking of answer, first you have to filter the domain which they have given. Next, to this filter the domains, we usually use the like operator and wildcard symbols. First, uh, to select the three columns that applying the exact alias names. Email like at aol.com where we use the wildcard symbols next like p percentage percentage is usually indicates in sql to check the matching patterns next if we look at the solutions we need aol.com name and a first name that should start with p it is a easy problem we can solve easily in the select statement we are going to select what are the contents we have to display so we are giving student id first name and email id for the from statement uh, from usually indicates the tables we are going to fetch uh, from students uh, email which is like at aol.com and their first name is p this is a AC questions. Next, we will look into the second questions, which is the flight ID and the name of a pilot of all the flights departing from Dubai, where, where the pilots have the destination captain. The pilot name should be displayed by the joining first name and the last name with a space, which means there is separate first name and the last name. We have to display it with a single name. First, you have to link some info like ID and departure city to the pilot info, which is name and destinations. Next, the pilot tables is an essential bridge between flights and the pilots steps or like join the three table use the concat for the full name filter where for dubai first we have to select flight id and concatenate first name and the last name as the pilot name we have to display this first name and last name in a pilot name and it is from the flight and we have to join this tables next we have to find where the departure city is equal to Dubai and their destination is equal to Captain. So here you will get uh, like to view database. So based on this only you can write query. While taking this photos I have gathered only questions and the sum of the questions have the database schema. So try to write questions basically without database schema here. After you can practice with a table. Next question is employee ID, name, basic salary and net pay for employee whose basic salary is greater than 5000. We have to display four columns which is employee ID, employee name, basic and net pay. In the select statement we have to give this. First we have to find the basic salary which is greater than 5000 and we have to calculate their net pay. Next, net pay is not stored. It must be calculators like basic plus allowance minus deductions. This is how we should uh, calculate our net pay. Next, we have to select the required columns and we should directly calculate net pay in the select statement. Use simple var class to filter out the basic. It is easy solutions. From the employee tables, we have to find the net pay and 
in the wear condition we have to check whether the basic is greater than 5000 so in this pdf you can find more sql question more than 30 plus sql questions over there and at the end of the pdf i have given some practice question to you like i have given table to you like these are the tips and tricks and in the database schema i have given the tables number of tables and i have given the practice questions with the solutions if you like to purchase this pdf it is cost only 15 rupees i don't like you to cost too much or i don't like you to pay more amount i have already created pdf for the technical assessment which contains coding questions and some sql and some html css and javascript questions and i have received lot of feedbacks about this pdf like most people have got more than 100 people 100 plus people have purchased this pdf and shared the review pdf i will uh, also share the link in the descriptions of the both sql and coding questions next we will get back into the next question before get back into the next question we will see how you should write a query once you open your metal uh, platform with your given link this is how sql query will be displayed on the left side you can find the question on the right side you will have this kind of options in the query part you have to write your query next in the view schema part you can view the tables which are connected based on the tables only you have to give answer then only the compiler will accept in the test cases there will be only one available test cases you can use that and check whether your query is wrong or correct and you can also run query using this options and important thing is if you are giving your first sql question and if you feel difficult and going to the second sql question thinking that after at the last we can complete our first question you cannot go back to the first questions once you changed into second questions i have done this mistake in my first technical assessment while writing my first question i find it is an hard and i skip to the second questions i cannot go back to the first question they restricted that option so be careful in that next we will see the next questions the transaction id the transaction amount or the transaction type of all the transactions whose transaction type is debit and the transaction amount is greater than 10,000 but less than 50,000 three outputs like transaction id amount transaction type first we will look at the thinking part we have to filter the transaction for the specific type and amount range next we can like uh, they are given range right so if they given range you have to keep in mind we should use the between operator from the 10,000 to 15,000 next we for the filter debit we usually use the option bar classes and we use the uncondition on amount using between next we will look into the solutions we have to select transaction id amount transaction type from transaction where transaction type equal to debit and amount between 10,000 and 50,000 i think this solutions we have discussed earlier the average amount of all the transaction that run through the credit card your out your output should have a column given below average credit amount we can see the table loan transaction in the transaction we can find the transaction id and they are asking average amount of all the transactions okay next account customer branch and account type next you will think about the solution first the average credit amount if you want to get an average select average amount where is the amount is present in the transaction table from transaction table where transaction type equal to credit they are asking the type of transaction is credit we have to find the transaction that is done to the credit based on the based on that we have to calculate the average that's all for this video i think i only explained four to five questions here 
In this PDF, you can find lot of questions to practice and crack your SQL assessment easily. If you purchase this, you find lot of tricks and tricks in between of each question. And this PDF will have September to June 2025. So don't miss this opportunities. I would recommend all you to buy. This PDF will be discounted in rate with only for 20 people will only get for 20 rupees. Other people will have to buy for more rupees thanks for watching do subscribe for all the valuable informations for more updates follow this channel